So, are you paying attention? Let's see. How do you say the following? P O K E. Yeah, that's poke. Okay, how about S M O K E? Well, of course, that's smoke. All right, how about B R O K E? Of course, that's broke. Finally, J O K E. That's a joke. All right, now, what do you call the white of an egg? So I'm wondering how many of you said yolk. That's the yellow part. We get in a rhythm and jump to a conclusion. We do that sometimes in our conversations. Someone starts a question and we head down the path we've been with others and miss something that's really important. Or maybe we're in a hurry and just don't take the moment to read everything in front of us. In a recent conversation in a chat support rep, I had to provide my account number three times. And then they wanted the last four digits of my wife's social security number. Yeah, that wasn't a real good interaction. Okay, or so maybe you missed a call, but the other person left a detailed voicemail with all the information you needed to act on. But instead of listening to that voicemail, you just punched that button and dialed them right back and said, Hey, you called me? So we know how important active listening is, but we seem to forget that sometimes in these situations. And when we do, it's similar to sitting face to face and looking at your phone or something else out of the window instead of paying attention to that other person. I like what Mike Bechtley has to say about that. Try being intentional today. Every time you want to look at your technology, stop and ask yourself why. He also tells us to be intentional about our relationships. So be intentional about listening when you're reading or thinking or responding. So let's see if you've gotten any better at paying attention. Check out the monkey business illusion and pay attention. <laughs>